We are doing a caudal glide at the hip joint. Um, evidence suggests that hip mobilization will decrease pain using the clinical prediction rules um, that ipsilateral knee flexion is less than 122 degrees, ipsilateral hip internal rotation is less than 17 degrees, and they have pain within the hip joint. So we're going to have my patient lying here supine on the table, um, and then I'm going to take the belt and have it around me. Then I'm going to put it through and have her leg go in here. Nope, wrong way. Trial and error. Okay, so you're gonna have the belt in her groin area as far as it's comfortable. And then I'm gonna move her up into flexion. And then I'm gonna apply that comma glide while moving her in and out of internal rotation to find where she has that decreased pain. Um, grades one and two can be applied to decrease pain and grades three and four can be applied to increase motion.